for today's video, yun nga, I'll share to you my haul visit to Korea and talagang I can say mas mura talaga ang mga skincare products doon. This is super mura. Hindi ko na sasabihin kung magkano. They are all free. Sobrang sulit. Hey Sunshines! Welcome and welcome back to the channel. So if you're new here, I'm Sherlyn. And for today's video, nag-upload ako ng travel trip ko to Korea. And this will be the first video that I will be shooting for 2024. So happy 2024 to all of you guys. And maraming salamat sa mga nag-subscribe na dito sa ating channel. And I hope you're enjoying everything kasi uh, we'll be having a lot of changes for this year. Um, hopefully, I get to share more about makeup and the travel and also mga beauty tips, tricks, and hacks. Also, with hair, I did blow dry my hair. Ngayon, kasi may pinuntahal lang kami kanina, but kulot pa rin. But I'm using the new Dyson Air Wrap and pinaglalaroan ko pa siya. I got it last November bago ako magpunta ng Korea. It was a Christmas gift from hubby and medyo pinaglalaroan ko pa siya because not all of the attachment can be used by curly hair. So, I'll share that to you on another video. But for today's video, yun nga, I'll share to you my haul. And after my Korea trip kasi last November, I got sick for a week. Medyo gumaling ng 3-4 um, days and then bumalik na naman. It's a cold flu and halo-halo na ubo and talagang it took me a while bago makarecover. So, parang more than a month a month and a half bago ako naka-recover and then holiday season na so ang dami nang ganap busy you know and all kaya this will be the first video ever for 2024 na sinimulan ko but anyway so yun na nga I had my Korea trip last November and kung makikita din nyo ang dami talagang skincare and makeup in Korea uh, that is my third visit to Korea and talagang I can say mas mura talagang mga skincare products doon. Makeup not so. It's now available here sa mga online platforms. So kung may difference man, usually like 300, 200 pesos. But still, mas mura pa rin sa Korea. So, I decided nung nasa Korea ko, uh, lahat ng mga Christmas gifts to family and friends to ko na binili mga skincare items and I'll share to you some baka sakali lang makatulong yeah with all your skincare and makeup so to start off yes we went to Myeongdong two consecutive days kami nagpunta doon because the first one is yung nga ubulan uh, and then gabi na noon that time kasi yung kadadating namin in Korea and then the following day bumisi na kami ulit and we went, of course, to Nature Republic. Yun naman ang medyo kilala talaga here sa atin in, of course, in Korea. So, I got some, of course, the sunblock. Uh, I've been using this for a couple of years now. And kasi ito yung uh, very affordable na sunblock, na I can say. So, this is SPF 50 plus, PA++++, this one. It's liquid. Personal preference is a liquid uh, sunblock for me. Although I do have the sunstick, yung mga sikat na sikat na sunstick right now. And unfortunately, when I went to Korea last November, around the world daw, na Nature Republic, hindi available yung kanilang famous na sunstick. So I didn't get to have one, pero recently, nagtingin ako sa SM Mall and yung Nature Republic doon, they, they sell the sunstick na. So I guess ngayon-ngayon lang siya naging available ulit. Of course, uh, another sunblock. Yung mga gantong sunblock yan, I, I gifted this to my family and friends kasi I've been using this one for maybe a year na. Yan, this one. This is the Foodaholic. I think this is the same or Basta, uh, same sila na itsura, but this is a Foodaholic sun cream. What I want with this cream is that very light siya, saka very uh, sheer siya. So, hindi siya nagsistick on the face and super light actually. 
So before my my makeup, I always use this one because very light nga siya. And then I use a primer, you know, and then my makeup ready. Another products na kinuha ko with Nature Republic are this one. Meron silang bagong line. It's the Good Skin. Di ko to nakita previously. Pero they have the niacinamide, they have a ceramide, a moisturizer. Di ko pa siya binubuksan. And may mga parang vitamin E. So, lahat sila magkaka tabi lang doon nakasabit. So, you get what you need and kung anong feeling mo kailangan mo. And like for this one, vitamin E, it says for glossy skin. It's good skin ampule, nature republic. So, hindi ko naggamit pero I have a few friends na pinagbigyan ko nito. And this cost only parang pag kinonvert mo here, it's only 350 pesos. Pero I get to see this online lately and parang nasa 700 pesos siya dito. So, doble. For skincare, usually doble talaga ang nagiging patong nila. Then, of course, yung mga ganito maliliit na lotion. This is super mura. Hindi ko na sasabihin kung magkano. At mga sabihin ng mga pinabigyan ko sobrang mura. Pero it works well. So, happy naman with this mini lotions. And then, I also got sunsticks nga. This one is from Tony Moly. And this one, parang sa airport ko na siya nabili. And parang pumapatak siya na, oh, like 500 pesos, yeah. Yun yung average ng mga sunstick in Korea, like 500 to 600 pesos. So, mura na din, pwede na din. Yun lang, you, you check the, yung mga bigat niya. Kasi yung iba, parang mas mahal, pero ang gaan lang niya. So, ito yung mga sulit na nakita ko. It's the Tony Moly and also the face, ay! So, and also the Misha, this one. Ito naman bilog, bilog type. So, ang daming promo ng Misha at that time. Kaya, we get to buy a lot of Misha products. I got to buy their mascara and eyeliner, the Ultra. Yun, binili ko din noong second time na nasa Korea ko in. Super maganda siya. Wait, I'll get it. So, this is the eyeliner. I got the brown and the black one. So, ayan siya. Maganda kasi yung dip niya. So, sobrang okay siya for point eyeliner. And then, parang usong-uso lately sa kanila yung eye cream. So, I got a Tony Moly eye cream. And this one is eye cream from Nature Republic. Parang kasama to sa set eh. Binigay ko sa mommy ko yung set nito. For the face. And then, this one is for the eyes. Yeah. So, sarado pa siya. So, you put it here sa sides. And under eyes, yeah, sa gabi, so that it can work overnight. And also for the face, parin, of course, ang mga sikat na sikat na mga face mask, face sheets nila. Unfortunately, face mask and face sheets don are not free anymore. Unlike the first time and second time around ko in Korea, they are all free. Like hindi ako halos bumili talaga ng face sheets na kasi every time na pupunta ka sa stores, they get to give you a lot, as in a lot of face sheets, like tatlo, apat, lima, minsan isang pack pa kahit na wala kang bibilin daw sa kanila. So, sasabihin nila, go, 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 just, just get it, just get it. You know? Ngayon, wala, you have to buy something para bigyan ka nila ng free na face sheet. Pero, ang masakit, their face sheet, would only, they would only give you like one, two pieces, swerte na na face sheet. Pero, hindi na hindi na siya libre. Kung baga, you have to buy something from them para bigyan ka nila at ano, uh, dagdaga ng dagdaga ng face sheet. So, bumili na lang din ako ng face sheet. So, kasi, this is very useful when it comes to moisturizing your skin. A day before ng, kunwari, meron kang lakad, uh, mag-attend ng binyag, wedding, or debut, whatever. Yung mga medyo big time events. 
So a day before, use your face sheets, face mask to moisturize your face para the following day when you put your makeup, sobrang flawless. So si Misha, nagbigay naman siya ng parang ganito, mga set na pwede nyo i-try, trial pack, mga facial cleanser, yan. Ito si Tony Bowden. And then, si Misha, pinagsama-sama ko na sila dito. Basta mga parang trial set sila na binigay. Which is okay din naman kasi when you travel, you can use this one para magaan sa mga kits nyo and traveling bags. Kaya I keep this or binibigay ko din, share ko kay sister ko para it can be useful to anybody. And sayang kasi din eh. So, Usually, isang gamit na lang naman ito. So, gamitin na yun na. I didn't get a lot of makeup products kasi parang it's really more on skincare thing for me kapag nag-travel sa Korea. But, since may mga sale, marami ding sale, and parang nahuhulog ang aking false eyelashes. <laughs> Nag-practice ako maglagay ng false eyelashes, guys, kasi I'm not really really fond of doing false eyelashes pero kanina tinry ko lang it. well anyway so I got to have some face products like this is the pastel cushion blusher from face shop in ito din veil glow blusher ito parang may may shine to it and for this one it's just a matte finish this one it's like a peach peachy pink so may pagka shiny siya parang may kasama ng highlighter when you put it on your face and the other one is just a pastel color ay hindi ko lang so cute kasi meron siyang puff and so very minimal ang kulay let's swatch it so don't share very very light and naisip ko this is very very good and medyo popular when it comes to teens and yung mga taga dito sa Philippines kasi they know uh, Perry Pera na and meron na din siya sa Watson's and SM Department Store. This is the Pera Pera. I got a few kasi ginawa ko pang regalo sa mga friends and family. This one, it can be used sa eyes, sa cheeks, and sa lips. Although sa eyes, hindi ko siya masyadong ginagamit. But it's more on the cheeks and the lips. And ang maganda with this one is that very travel-friendly. Pwede nyo ilagay sa kit nyo. So it's a multi-use na product. Peri Pera. Yeah. Swatch natin. It's very mousse type. Yeah. And sobrang makapal siya sa unang lagay, pero very pigmented. So, sobrang ganda niya sa lips. Lagay na. And also sa cheeks talaga. Super nice. And it has a smell to it. Hmm, ang bango, parang very, very light. And ang nakakatuwa is, it's, re, it's half the price, more than half the price sa Korea. Because here, it's being sold like 599 pesos nung nagtanong ako sa, sa SM. But I don't know if pare-pareho sila kasi meron yung parang nude, pink velvet. Pero nung tinignan ko parang... Parang medyo close naman ang mga finish nila sa, sa cheeks. And sa Korea, parang it cost almost 300 pesos lang. So, pang mura. Kaya pinangregalo ko din ito. Well, it's still pera-pera. 
So I hope yung mga nakatanggap na friends ko nito and family members eh masaya. <laughs> Dahil this is a multi-use product na po pwede sa kit ninyo and you can use it underneath your makeup if you want to do an underpainting. But if not, you can also use it on top of your foundation. And of course, syempre sa lips. Medyo known si, si Korea sa mga magagandang finish ng lip products. I also got one lipstick from Rome. And <laughs> correct me if I'm wrong. Basta that one, I'll, I'll put the, the name here. And ang nakakatawa with all their line is sa lipstick. More on pastel color siya. Ang ganda ng mga finish nila sa lips. So, wala kami ginawa ng friend ko to kundi mag-swatch na mag-swatch and wala na kami pakailan. Parang, o oh, sige, try na natin. Minsan, we'll just wipe it out and then try na namin talaga sa, sa lips. Kumbaga, san clean ng konti. Not really sanitize, pero i-clean namin ng konti and then lalagay na namin sa lips. Parang, sige na. Give na give na ito. Wala na kami pakialam. But, you know, it, it works. So, nakita namin yung mga finish ng mga lipsticks. And I got one lang naman. My friend got a lot, alam ko. Di ba, Jay? <laughs> so, she got a lot. And mukhang nga-enjoy naman niya. Kasi more on a lipstick person naman siya. Ako kasi more on uh, face palette, mga ganyan. Eye, eye shadow. Not so much on the lips. Pag sa lips kasi parang nabubura din siya agad and then you have to to reapply kaya parang I felt na hindi siya thing for me para bumili ng maraming maraming lipstick and then last but not the least I got a cleansing balm it's from Vanilla and Co I'll just put the picture here somewhere and it's sobrang mura actually sa sa Korea. Parang yung pinakamalaki nila is like, pag kinonvert is only 700 pesos. Uh, pero dito, pag nakikita ko siya sa mga pop-up stores like in uh, Glorieta, it's like 1,200 I believe. Correct me if I'm wrong, let me know. Pero alam ko parang 1,200 yung pinakamalaki nila. And it is super effective in removing your makeup. Actually, all, most of all cleansing balms naman are effective in removing makeup products. Pero, it's just so happy na kasi medyo mahal nga si Vanilla Co dahil nga medyo branded na rin and no na yung name niya sa, sa skincare products. But, my friend Jade was very, very happy with this one kasi actually, we're, look, we're just buying sana yung mga maliliit Actually, inisip din namin pang gift nito. Pero nakita namin malaki para pa. Sige na nga, ito daw nga lang malaki ang bilhin natin. So, that one is sobrang sulit. So, bumili kami ng isang malaki. Actually, kulang nga daw. Dapat pala dinalawa na namin or even tatlo. Pero, yun nga. Sulit yung pagbili ng cleansing balm na yun. So, I get to use it and my friend get to use it pag alis, pag remove ng makeup at least hindi siya magkaklag sa skin ninyo and hindi siya magkakos ng any irritation or any pimples after. So it's really really worth it to have a cleansing balm. So I guess that's it. It's just a short video for my Korea haul na mga products and it was really fun going there and talagang ang sulit ng mga skincare products doon. Although next time I think pagbalik ko, if babalik ako, I want to try yung mga Clio na products, ganyan, mga pang eyeshadow. I don't know how it works sa skin type natin, sa weather natin, pero parang napaka-pastel kasi ng mga kulay ng kanilang mga eyeshadow. So, hindi ko alam kung... I haven't tried anything yet ng mga eyeshadow nila. And it's interesting to have one. So, I might buy online na lang or kung makabalik, you know, uh, buy more. So, try natin yan. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope you like this video. Please give it a thumbs up and I'll see you all guys on the next one. Please share and subscribe. Thanks. Bye.